coverage you can count on. This is 12 News Now at Noon. We're following breaking news. A person found dead after a home goes up in flames. Police are investing this, investigating this as a homicide. And the cleanup just getting started after those devastating tornadoes. One postal worker is not letting the destruction stop him from delivering mail. Sunny start to the weekend. It's very warm out there. Look at that, 62 degrees. But well, we're tracking some wet and colder weather for your weekend. We'll check in with Brittany Trumpy in just a moment. Thanks. <coughs> First this noontime. We're reporting on schools all over the country <coughs> today due to a disturbing social media challenge calling for acts of violence. North Providence High School temporarily went into lockdown this morning because of images that were circulating on social media. Police were investigating and they gave the school the all clear to resume their activities shortly thereafter. And we have heard from several superintendents today who tell us that they don't have any information to believe that the, cre the uh, threats are credible. However, they also say they are ready just in case. Let's check in with Brittany Schaefer. She spoke with Westport superintendent. She's live outside of the Middle Senior High School with new information. Brittany? Well, Danielle, Superintendent Thomas Aubin tells me they have stepped up all safety measures at all of their schools today. He tells me regardless, the threats still are having an impact on student attendance. 